Did you have a happy childhood? Yes, I did. I enjoyed playing hide and seek with my peers. Did you experience your childhood in a city or countryside? I spent my childhood in a rural area where I could see vast rice fields. Did you usually skip class when you were a child? Yes, I did, and many of my friends did too. Who were you with when you were a child? I was with my beloved family. What did you want to be when you were a child? I dreamed of being a fashion designer. Who did you love the most when you were a child? I loved my mom the most, since she was always there and took care of me. Who was your childhood hero? Robin Hood. He took money from the rich and gave it to the poor. What reminds you of your childhood? Green rice fields, which I happen to see everywhere, remind me of my beautiful childhood. Did you change a lot when you grew up? Yes, of course. I'm more mature now, both physically and mentally. Why is childhood important? Because it shapes people into who they will become. How many rooms are there in your house? There are six rooms a living room, two bedrooms, a bathroom, and a kitchen. Which floor is your bedroom on? My bedroom is on the first floor of a three story house. Is it big or small? It's not very spacious, just enough to put necessary furniture in. What color is your bedroom painted? It's painted pink, my favorite color. Love your room? Why? I love it very much because it is my private space whenever I go home. What furniture does your bedroom contain? It contains a bed, a desk, and a clothing closet. What do you do in it? Well, I spend most of my free time there reading books and sleeping. How much time do you spend in your room? About 10 hours a day, especially in the evening. Share your room with anyone else? No, everyone in my family has their own room, so I stay there alone. What kind of presents are popular in your country? It depends on the receivers. For children, toys are the best choice. For youth, souvenirs are recommended. Who gave presents to you? On what occasions? I have received many presents, most of which were from my friends. They gave me gifts on my birthday. What was your last present? It was a handmade doll given by my best friend when I moved to another city. What was the one you liked best? I loved my book Nepal a lot. It was given to me on my 23rd birthday by my brother. Did you ever get a present you didn't like? Yes, I have, but I still treasure and take care of them. How do you thank people who give you presents? I gave them presents that they would like. What are the times of the year that people give presents in your country? Some special occasions are birthdays, weddings, graduation, New Year's Day, Valentine's Day, housewarming ceremonies, etc. Who was the last person you gave a present to? My mom. I bought her a coat on a business trip to Bangkok. Is giving presents important in daily life? Yes, it is. It's one of the best ways to show your love and gratitude to someone. Which tourist attractions do you prefer when traveling? Historical places or natural landmarks? Well, historical places are always my first choice when traveling. What do you usually do when visiting historical places? I usually listen to the tour guide introducing the sites and take notes about important historical events. Can you name some historical places you have visited? Whenever I travel to a foreign country, I always visit its famous historical places. Some of them are the pyramids in Egypt, Angkor Wat in Cambodia, Stonehenge in England, and the Taj Mahal in India. What's your most favorite historical place? Why? I love the pyramids the most. Taking a tour around the pyramids, I can not only enjoy the gorgeous architecture, but also learn cultural and historical values of the ancient Egyptian culture. What is the most famous historical place in your country? It's definitely the Statue of Liberty in New York City. What's special about it? The statue was gifted by the people of France, 
It is a symbol of freedom for the U.S. as well as a welcoming site to people coming to the U.S. from another country. Where is it located? It's located on Liberty Island in New York Harbor, NYC. Should the youth visit historical places instead of other places? Sure. Nowadays, the youth should visit these kind of places more often in order to preserve historical and cultural values of their country. What are the